Hi everybody and a warm welcome back to Maple Leaf Customs. I'm Andrew and on the bench today is a 1 to 64 scale Hot Wheels 1971 Datsun 510 wagon. It hasn't got any wheels. The rest of it is complete and in fine condition. I got this car from Sam Ed Wheels. They send out bear casting, something like this one, to all of their collaborators with the challenge to dress it up however you wish and put a new pair of Sam Ed wheels on it. Done and done. I'm not even going to strip the paint off this, but I will fancy it up a little bit and it'll certainly get a new set of shoes. Here are the parts all on display now. It's a plastic interior. Bucket seats up front and a bench in the back. I hope that's accurate to 1971. I can't quite remember the wagon. Plastic base with some possibility for detail on the bottom. The glass is fine. This is not new out of the blister pack. Samed has done the silver trim around the windows and put one of their logos on there and it's got a nice high gloss black paint job. As I said, I'm not stripping it. I'm just going to buff it up a little bit here and I'm putting some of my own decals right over top of theirs starting with some ghost white base decals. I wonder if you can guess what this is going to be. Hmm. Here's the exact same image inverted to go on the driver's side door and a little bit on the front quarter panel. And I'll just let your imagination run wild for a little while. It's going to be a simple but effective look on this JDM car. Now I covered up the Sam Med Wheels logo on the passenger door and the driver's door, but I do replace it on the rear quarter panel and a larger one prominently displayed right on the hood. I've been giving you a few teasers that coming up in September as a thank you for 3,000 subs is a three customs giveaway. All you've got to do is be a subscriber to qualify for that. More information coming. Today's community shout out goes to Diecast Clown. If you're not already familiar with that website, follow the link in the description and be sure to swing by for a hello and a thumbs up and give them a new sub and tell them you came by from Maple Leaf Customs. Thank you. According to Wikipedia, the Datsun 510 was a series of the Datsun Bluebird sold from 1968 to 1973 and offered outside the US and Canada as the Datsun 1600. The 510's engineering was inspired by contemporary European sedans, particularly the 1966 BMW 1600-2. The 510 range became famous for Nissan's rallying successes outside Japan and paved the way for greater Nissan sales internationally. Now you can get the vision for what I'm doing with the decals. It's a traditional Japanese dragon. It's a JDM car after all. Simply in light blue and white, which stands out brilliantly, I think, over the gloss black body. I'll repeat it on the passenger door, and the Sam Ed Wheels logos remain white on black. Let's pop it back together and see how it all looks. I gave the glass a little buffing as well, and you saw a steering wheel exchange and a red gear shift knob. That's the extent of the interior detail. I'm going to give you a little fashion show now with a couple of different sets of Sam Ed wheels for comparison purposes before I decide on the pair that I want to keep. These ones are gold. And they're very sharp wheels, but uh, it's not talking to me on this car. But I wanted to have a look. Set number two. They clip in easily in the tabs on the plastic base.
big white walls with black rims. That kind of matches the color palette that I've got going here. All right, off they come. Let's try a third set here. I'm not screwing it back together every time. These are white tires with black rims. Hmm. Mm hmm hmm. Maybe. Off to the side with these ones. Set number four, the final look. And then I'll make a decision. These are lettered wheels. See that? Salmon wheels. Bronze rims. And once again, really nice looking wheels, but I'm not sure they're the best look for this 510 wagon. Okay, you can visit www.samedwheels.com and see their inventory. And when you make your order, be sure to use the promo code Maple Leaf and they'll throw in something free as a little surprise with your order. Right, here's the little 510 wagon. Up close and personal now, I decided to go with set number two with the big white walls and the black rims. I think that matched the best out of the four choices that I tried. You can see the decal work that was done. Team Samet, I hope you're happy with this. Here's what I received in the mail. And here's what it looks like now. Because it's a JDM car, I went with a traditional Japanese dragon. See it in my garage diorama, and from every angle, I left the silver window trim that Sam had did. They did up the front grille and the lights and the tail lights. I didn't alter any of that. I just put the decals on and put on a new set of Sam Ed wheels. I put all of my customs into a blister pack like this that I make up. This one doesn't have any breakable parts that could be swallowed, so it goes to my local Goodwill shop as a free gift for a little boy or girl, and I hope they'll be happy with this one. My thanks to Sam Ed Wills for being such a great sponsor of Maple Leaf Customs, and my thanks to you for visiting my channel today. Drive carefully. It's coffee time.